पतंजलि चावन प्रास प्रो रेसलिंग लीग सीजन तीन के आज के इस फाइनल में अब वक्त है महिलाओं के छिहत्तर किलोग्राम वर्ग कुश्ती का हरियाणा हैमर्स की ओर से आ रही है भारतीय मूल की पूजा सिहाग और एनसीआर पंजाब रॉयल्स की ओर से आ रही है फ्रांसीसी मूल की Crowd loving the action as it's unfolding. Yogesh Mardat, Geeta Fogat in attendance, looking on as Pooja Sehag of the Haryana Hammers will go up for the next contest, the women's 76 kg category, the 20 year old. Is up against a very, very talented competitor from France, the 19-year-old Kumba Doro, who won four bouts in PWL3, just lost one. And the Malik to officiate this contest in the dormitory box, and Raman Banot with the Anupam Gulati. Yes, indeed, we are looking forward to this bout as well, and it was a 6-2 verdict uh, in favour of uh, Kumba Larok in the last contest that these two had uh, met on the 16th of the month. So it's 2-1, uh, there's an opportunity here for the two teams to draw level. And uh, well, points straight away coming in for Larok. So 19-year-old, uh, she's a student of physiotherapy, first year in France and she comes from Africa originally from Mali so she's of Mali descent and what is interesting Anupam we were talking to her in the commentary box earlier a few days ago and I said how do you manage your downtime when you're not resting when you're not training she said completing assignments and doing homework for the, for the physiotherapy course that's that, that, she's, that she's doing back home that's right and she's got examinations on the 29th of January back when she gets contact. back to France a very serious student so she's uh, definitely packing in quite a punch on the mat and academically of it. Yes, absolutely. And uh, she's got a lot of credentials. Uh, she's been a gold medal winner of the Under-23 World Championship last year. And uh, in, uh, she's been gold medal winner of the European Championships again in 2017. So she's got 19 years of age and she's going to get better and better as time goes on. And remember in the senior category as well, when she competed, she went on and uh, got a bronze in the in the open category, the senior category. Impressive. She's already taken gold in the under 23 category as well. That's right. And her father was in the French army and uh, posted in Mali. So thereafter getting married to uh, her mother and the rest is history, but they live in France now. Cynthia Vescan looking on. Uh, it's good to see grapplers, uh, wrestlers who've competed for all different teams in PWL3 still in attendance here at the City Fort Sports Complex watching the final unfold. 2 0 for Kumba. Nothing for uh, Pooja. He's still trying to get into grips. But it would appear that uh, the French girl is a fit superior at this moment she's wrestled earlier with her in the past it was a 6-2 in her favor the warning coming in uh, for passivity this will be against puja puja sihag she comes from uh, sisai village in hisar district of haryana so everybody enjoying uh, their stay here in pwl for some, it's been a very happy hunting ground. They've had a good experience away from the wintry snow of Europe, or uh, Helen for that matter, who we'll be seeing uh, from uh, the United States. She'll be on show in just a bit. But 3 0 for Comba. We're still in the first round. So this is not very aggressive. It's happening at a very leisurely pace, so to speak, with uh, Comba. Larock not willing to give anything okay. away and finding us a, a difficult uh, obstruction and obstacle 
is uh, the uh, player from this year as they go up against the defending champions NCR Punjab Royals. Kumba leading 3 to nothing versus Pooja Sihag and a great opportunity for Kumba to level the tie score at 2 all with a win in this tie in this particular bout. Uh, Pooja Sihag, well, I'm sure has been told by her coaching staff to go out, be a little aggressive, but she's lost her balance and a point already gone against her. Here's a great opportunity for uh, Pumba to capitalize on that. She's got uh, two points from the last one, making it five to nothing. And uh, the way things are going well, there it is, an attempt and losing balance, slipping a bit and completely in control is uh, Kumba Larok from NCR Punjab Royals. Five to nothing. We're in the second round. And this is the fourth tie in the final of PWL 13. We've had a huge attendance here. It's a house full at Delhi's Siri Fort uh, Sports Complex. As Kumba continues with her winning ways, she's had four victories, one reversal in the PWL of the league stage. And in case she's going to win this one, it's going to be uh, her fifth victory. It'll be a very creditable record in PWL 3 Raman. Absolutely, Anupam. The only loss that she faced was uh, when she lost to Vasiliza. Lost to Vasiliza Marzoliak of the Real Marathas 2-6. But barring that loss, Kumba, who's just 19 years old, has redeemed this, you know, has actually given a good account of herself. She won versus uh, Zanet Nemeth, beat Pooja Sehaud as well, beat Cynthia Veskin, and then beat uh, Vasiliza Marzoliak in the uh, semi finals as well. Center, center. So we're entering the last minute of this bout. Contact! And uh, it's going to be uh, exceedingly difficult. Sihag from uh, Ariana Hammers to bring this off. But she is attempting, but well, we'll probably see more aggression coming in from Kumba. She's not going to be happy finishing off with five, but there, more points coming in for her. So, two more come for Kumba. That's 7-0. Just see how that uh, attack has come. And uh, she's managed to get that uh, couple of points with proper aggression. And now just about 20 seconds to go. So, it's going to be at the end of the fourth tie. It'll be a 2-2. And this, uh, my word, uh, is definitely going to the wire. So winning alternately the two bouts it'll be interesting to see crucial ones to come up in the middle but that is uh, all over then for Ariana hammers in this and uh, the referee Malik says it's all over Kumbala Rock winning this quite comfortably 7-0 in this tie to make it 2-2 for NCR Punjab Royals this final. Authoritative display 